Frank Tool Spotlight, the trend buzz. Are you interested in learning what keywords real shoppers are searching on Etsy for right now? Those top trending, trendy terms. Erank has a tool for that. Under trends, trend buzz. But even before you head over there with some data, right on your dashboard of Erank. On the right hand side, see this trending on Etsy? This shows you the top most searched for keywords on Etsy in the past week. You can choose between several countries in the drop down here to see what was hot in your country or perhaps countries you ship to. You see the position, the keyword, that's the word or phrase that buyers are searching for, and the change in position from the last time period. You can click on any of the keywords and get taken to the keyword tool page for that keyword to see the search trend of this keyword over time and even to see if there are any other similar relevant keywords. And to get to the full trend buzz tool from any page on eRank, you just have to click on trends trend buzz. And here there is so much more information. Currently I can see the keywords that were most searched for on Etsy in the USA for the past 30 days. You can see the position, keywords and change just as before. And also here we have the search trend graph which shows how much the keyword was searched for over the past 15 months. The past month is highlighted in blue. Hover over the bars to see the month and the estimated amount of people searching for the term in that month. You can see here if a keyword is just suddenly trending, growing in popularity or not, and if it's seasonal. In these drop downs, you can again pick between different countries like before. And now we can choose between the past 30 days, past seven days, or even yesterday to see what was hot in these time periods. And down on the left hand side, you can pick between lots of marketplaces and platforms to see what were the hottest trending keywords on them. Let's go back to Etsy in the USA for the past 30 days, because here we've some extra tabs. The relative popularity of colors, products, recipients, styles and materials based on what Etsy customers are searching for. But how would you use this data? I wouldn't recommend spending hours on this tool. I find it much more helpful to get a quick overview regularly to get a feel for what's trending. Every time you're on eRank, a quick glance at the terms on the dashboard can give you an idea. For example, if people have just suddenly started searching for Mother's Day or Easter, or if a new keyword has just appeared out of nowhere. This way, you may be able to get some new products listed before there's much competition. And a quick deeper dive into the trends monthly or quarterly. But in general, most of these keywords will be very high competition and very broad keywords, so you're unlikely to want to use these keywords as your superstar keywords. For example, jewellery is always ranking high, but jewellery as a tag would be pretty pointless. More we want to see and realise that as a product, jewellery is popular on Etsy. What type of jewellery? Potentially earrings. And if birthday gifts is suddenly doing well now, how about try some birthstone earrings for some of the up and coming birth months, perhaps in gold for a male teacher? But if it's all too much to try and analyse these trends, never fear, our lovely Jan over at the E-Rank blog really keeps her finger on the pulse of all this data. And every month she reports on what's hot and not on Etsy in several countries and marketplaces. A read through of them every month can keep you up to date on what's trendy. And you can always pop over and join the Facebook group if you have any questions. With nearly 30,000 members from all around the world, there's always some great discussions and advice.